Hey everybody and welcome back to a vlog. I am currently in Cambridge and I stayed over last night and I figured I would start the vlog today since last night was really just driving. Uh, just got some gas as you can see. And I am headed to my company holiday party, which we are having it on the 13th of February. But you know what? Better late than never, right? So we are actually going bowling in Sartell, Minnesota. And hopefully I can do some bowling footage for you guys. I'm not sure how that's gonna like play out, but um, obviously you'll see in just a moment how that's gonna work out um, and then tomorrow I am leaving and going home but I figured it would be kind of fun to get some bowling shots um, and then we're gonna do a dinner as well but I'm not gonna like film any of the people but I'll film kind of what I'm doing so anyway I will check in with you after I'm done with my holiday party and let's go on a little bowling journey and by the way I like totally suck at bowling so it'll be really interesting to see what my school Score ends up being. I will for sure share my score with you guys because it is going to be sad unless unless they sprung for bumper bowling which I'm pretty sure they didn't but that would be totally epic. creepy light I am um, it's like 9 17 and just got done with my work party had some really good times I didn't take a ton of vlog footage kind of like I said before I just wanted to take you know just some general things of what I was doing which is the idea of a vlog but we had a really fun dinner with some really funny awards and I got an award for being the most OCD slash organized and I got a um notebook of paper which I will definitely use um, if you follow me on Instagram you will probably see this notebook of paper at some point so anyway um, just wanted to give you a little update it's just really fun to like hang out with a lot of the other people from the locations that I don't work at I mean I see these people um, like on video conferencing most days and we email a lot and stuff too but it's just kind of nice to like get together and you know kind of talk about work but then also just like you know talk about like your personal life like what's going on with you and like updates and you know that kind of stuff so anyway okay I think somebody is waiting for my parking spot so I am going to head out and get back to Cambridge and I will check in with you guys tomorrow So I just got back and I think I don't really have anything to do and the night is kind of young um, and when I mean young I mean it's like 10 o'clock but I don't have anything to do in the morning besides just drive back to Fargo so I think let me show you what I'm gonna do okay so I think I am going to do a face mask and um, I actually bought this this is the Yes to Tomatoes Clear Skin for Acne Prone Skin. And this is the Detoxifying Charcoal Mud Mask. I really like the Charcoal Mud Mask from um, Origins, but I got this at Target a while back to kind of just like live out here. So I want to test it out and I figured I would show you guys since this vlog is like going to be 
probably super short because there's not a lot going on. Um, so yeah, I am going to wash all of the makeup off of my face and then I'm going to apply this and I will let you guys know what I think mid mask and then I'll let you know what I think after the mask. Okay, so let's do this thing. Okay, so to wash the face, we need this. This is my Clarisonic Mia 3, which I love. And of course I got the white one in the end. I use the Cetaphil Daily Facial Cleanser, which is my absolute favorite. And then I will apply this guy in three, two, one. Ah, it's on! All right, so, like I said, this is the Yes to Cucumbers, or sorry, Yes to, yes to Tomatoes. I can't talk today. Um, just put it on, it, directions are Apply a generous layer of mud mask to face. Leave on for 10 minutes, then rinse with water. So um, very similar to the Origins one. I gotta say, I like the smell of this one better. It just, it doesn't smell like super medicinal, I guess. I guess the other one, like the Origins one, I'll leave links below for you guys. I really, I rarely ever leave any kind of like links for you when I do a vlog. But I'll leave links to this, which I got this at Target, and I'll leave the links to the Origins one too. The Origins one is a lot more expensive. I'm not sure if I like this yet, but I will update you in just a few minutes. Um, but yeah, I like the way this smells. Like, I don't know, it kind of smells like fresh or something. I don't know, but it's so weird. Um, like I keep looking like up a little bit because um, my little viewfinder is right there. Like. Bah. Anyway, super weird. But I totally forgot to um, mention in my skincare removal routine, I should show you um, the thing that I use to get off the bulk of my makeup, which are these. These are the um, Up and Up wipes that I use in the blue package. The blue package is like 100% where it's at. These are just by up and up there's a 30 count in here and these are just refreshing wet cleansing towelettes so they just help remove the makeup before like the clarisonic and i just find that this gives me like a really nice like deep clean to my face and then even if i don't do a mask like it just allows for like moisturizers and things like that to just like really um sink into the skin which i don't know i i obviously like the way that is so anyway i can already feel this tightening up a little bit so i am going to wait the 10 minutes and check back in just a little bit Whew, okay i am like majorly refreshed now um mask is off obviously my skin is like pink because you know hot water or warm-ish water and scrubbing you know that happens anyway i have to say i think i prefer this mask more than the origins one it was really really easy um very very simple to get off you didn't have to like scrub too hard um i haven't put any moisturizer on yet after this but um you know just some warm-ish water and you know just kind of scrub with your hands sometimes you, with the origins one you have to um you know kind of scrub kind of hard but you didn't really have to with this one which i'm really really impressed with so i know this like whole video is turning into this like face mask review but i figured you know I don't have much to talk about this vlog, so why not incorporate something a little bit fun? Right, right. Okay, so I'm gonna do the rest of my skincare routine and I am gonna go to bed, cause you know, rocking Saturday night here. But I will see you guys in the morning. Happy Sunday, today is February 14th. And I am in the same gas station that I was in yesterday. Apparently, I really love vlogging in this gas station. But um, I am about to hit the road and just wanted to fuel up and get ready. But I did want to give an update on the face mask situation last night. So, um, woke up this morning and my face felt really good. Like, really 
like supple and just hydrated even though that was like an acne mask so I would definitely recommend it and again um, I don't know if I said this yesterday I can't remember um, but I will link it below for you guys if you're interested but I got mine at Target and I'm pretty sure you can get it other places too anyway so um, I have fueled up I've got my caffeine and this coke bottle says share a coke with a cheerleader Fun fact, if you guys didn't know me personally in high school, I was in fact a cheerleader. So, um, yeah, that's funny. Um, I'm pretty sure if you scroll back on my Instagram, I'm pretty sure I did like a throwback Thursday or a flashback Friday of me in my cheerleading outfit at one point or another. So anyway. But yeah, just wanted to close out the vlog here. I hope you guys had a great Valentine's weekend. Uh, this little poocher pooch and I are heading back to Fargo right now. And we've got about four hours of driving ahead of us. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will talk to you all very soon. Bye. You say bye, Doyle? Say bye, guys. See you later. No, say bye, guys. Say bye everybody, I'll see you later. Alright, he doesn't want to talk. Okay, I'll see you guys later.